Okay, so this right here is a fire extinguisher. Um, so I recently did a video on this fire extinguisher, and this is a modern fire extinguisher. Um, it has dry chemical in it, and it's pressurized. When you pull the pin and push this, it will shoot out the dry chemical for the fire. So before this, they may they may have been made out of when they first started putting out fires. They probably used a bucket, you know, the buckets that you see every day. But they weren't made like they weren't made from plastic then. They might have been made out of um, like leather. So. And that's what so at first I used the fire the firefighters used um, water to take put out the fires then they uh, and the buckets um, were um, the bucket material was started with leather and then maybe a plastic or no, a leather, a rubber. It says, 1940s, a rubber replaced leather. And then maybe, and then later on, they went away with the buckets. Well, maybe they stayed with the buckets and they introduced a thing, um, glass bottles. They introduced glass bottles in 1863 that um, where you would throw them and they were filled with um, some type of chemical, tetrachloride or salt mixture and that would put out the fire um, so that mystery fire Copper container contains potassium carbonate with compressed air. Where this is says to operate turn handle to the left work like a pump. So this, based off of this reading, a vehicle type. This came after that first one. This is another example of another technology. It looks like it says heavy vehicle type. And it's a pump. Manufacturer. Can't really read it. So yeah, that's a pump. And after that, they maybe came out with another technology. This one. The thing is that they kind of look the same. First fire extinguisher, and then went this one, and the one that looked kind of looked like this, and they kind of looked the same, you know. And then they came out with something that looked like this, which is a modern day fire extinguisher that I have right beside me, filled with dry chemical and it's pressure. And, um, and of course, around the world, there are many other examples of fire extinguishers. There's foam, water, CO2, dry powder, water, fire extinguishers. Um, just like there are many types of guns, there are many types of fire extinguishers. Um, right? Yeah. 